What's going on, my people? Odal Anti Imperial to Chill here. One name, three personalities. Odal Anti Imperial to Chill. So, guy reached out to me, said that he found out um, he was being cheated on, and he said he's just depressed. You know, he doesn't want to do anything. Like he's called out from work a couple of times. You know, this week and and just things like that. And he just like he just wants to stay in bed, and he doesn't know what to do. And this is for guys and girls. This is for men and women. If you find that, um, that you know, and I understand, like I get it. When you get cheated on, the pain, the anger, the sadness that you feel is something that it's, it's almost indescribable. Like unless you've been in love or something like that and you've been cheated on, that's a pain that many people can't even understand or describe or put into context. And so this is one way I'm going to try to help you all out. This is, like I said, this is for men and women, boys and girls, right? I'm going to try to help you all out. What you need to do when you're going through a bad breakup, when you're feeling that pain, when you've been cheated on, when you're so sad, and you feel lonely and depressed, right? What you need to do is you need to turn that pain into profit. Let me explain. <laughs> Somebody said, some, uh, some, uh, some girl reached out to me, uh, some female reached out to me. She said, I love when you do the, when you're about to give like the lesson, you say, let me explain. <laughs> so, all right, so for all of you guys, you need, to, you need to turn your pain into profit. Let me explain. <laughs> so what you need to do is, and you're going to be sad, and you're going to be depressed, and you're going to be lonely. I understand that. You're going to feel like you want to just curl up in your bed and kind of forget the world outside, you know, because you're thinking about, that you know you know your boyfriend or girlfriend your husband or wife you're thinking about the way they're having sex with somebody else that tears you up inside you're thinking about how they don't really want you anymore how they're lying to you or you caught them lying to you about having sex and being with somebody else and that's as i said before almost an indescribable pain when you get cheated on, I have videos called death, death by cheating or something like that. Because when you get cheated on, you feel like, like, you, like your insides, like your heart is dying. Right? You have a broken heart. So the first thing you want to do, you need to turn this pain into profit. The first thing you want to do is you're going to want to lay in bed and curl up. Do it. Cry. Lay in bed, cry, curl up under the covers, curl up under the blanket. Do that for the day you have to do it. Do that for, you know, a few hours. Put a time limit on that. Put, turn your alarm clock on, on your phone. Say, okay, I'm gonna I'm a give myself four hours or I'm gonna give myself three hours. I'm gonna give myself five hours. After that, I'm getting up. I'm getting up and I'm getting to work. So what you wanna do, step one, from turning your pain into profit, you go through your sadness, go through your depression, get in your bed, curl up under your sheets, but set a time limit to that. Six hours, four hours, three hours. Turn your alarm clock on, give yourself time, okay? Once that phase is over, when that alarm clock goes off, jump up. You use that pain and sadness that you have, you focus it. You turn it into anger if you need to. You focus it on starting to work on something. Turn your pain into profit. You focus that pain. You get up, 
after that alarm clock goes off, you focus that pain into remembering your story, writing a book, start start writing a book. Easy, the easiest thing you could do, jump, record yourself, how you feel. Just kind of like what I'm doing right now. But just record yourself like this. Hop on your phone, record yourself. Tell, tell us all your story. Tell us all what happened in your relationship. Tell us when it went wrong. Tell us how you feel. Tell us how sad you feel. Tell us how angry you feel. Record yourself. Just like this. Like this. Record yourself. Because you never know who else is feeling like that out there. And you never know, you know, you upload your recording onto YouTube or whatever. And you never know, right? You never know if it might turn into something that makes you money. That brings you profit. So you take that pain that you went through. That sadness that you went through, that anger, take that pain and turn it into profit. You can write a book about your, your, your relationship. Write a book about being cheated on. Right? That's a longer vision. But to jump on and just record yourself and how you feel, your raw emotions, that takes nothing. Everybody has a phone with a camera. Record yourself. Just like this. Upload it. That can lead you to profit. Turn your pain into profit. You guys know I do music. Whatever I'm feeling, I can put right into my music. I make the beat that sounds like the type of feeling that I feel, and then I just put a little bit of lyrics into it. If you make music, turn your... And out that music that I make, I get paid a lot of money off of that, you all. I turn my pain... If I ever have pain, I turn it into profit. I get on here. I'm honest about telling you guys things. I'm honest about telling you guys when you're going through stuff, how you feel about it. I turn my pain, I turn pain into profit. I make music about it. There's so many different things you can do. But for you to just be, like, let's say, get cheated on or they broke up with you, for you to be sad, depressed, lonely, and then just be depressed. And after all of that and you're crying and all of that, after it's done, it's just done. And you have nothing to show for it. You're wasting your time. To be sad and depressed and just laid up in bed. And then you can lay up in bed for two weeks straight. You can lay up in bed for a week straight. Okay, so you were sad, you were depressed, you were in pain. You lay under the covers and cried your eyes out for three days straight, five days straight. Okay, now what do you have to show for that? Nothing. You just wasted five days laying under the covers crying. And at the end of the day, you have nothing else to come from that. You have no... You have not improved any aspect of your life in any way by just laying in bed crying. So you turn your pain into profit. At least after you've cried and all that, at least you have something that you did from it. At least you have something to show for that came from that that you could possibly make money off of, make a profit off of. There's another way you can turn your pain into profit doesn't have to be monetary profit doesn't have to be economic profit it doesn't have to be money you guys you can also turn your pain into profit by improving yourself for example once you go through the depression and the sadness and you're under the covers as I said set your alarm give yourself three hours five hours six hours once that alarm goes off get up Show and start improving yourself immediately. Go for a long walk. Go for a run. Go for a jog. Go to the gym and lift weights and exercise. 
that is turning a profit because you're you're turning a profit for your life you're turning a profit for your health you're improving yourself out of the sadness that's what it's all about whether it's money whether it's getting your body better whether it's skin care whether it's whatever take your sadness your pain your depression your loneliness that you're feeling from this breakup from being cheated on and improve yourself in some way from this. Whether it's exercise, whether it's making a video about what happened and, and putting it out into the into the to the world through the internet and seeing if you can get money from it. Even if you don't get put it this way, let's say if I got cheated on and I was depressed, right? I got on here and made a video just like I'm making now. Even if this video doesn't make you automatic money, this video might be the video that somebody sees that makes them look for your channel, subscribe to your channel. And then another video that you might make two months from now might be the one that blows up. But this video might be the video that sparks somebody's interest in you and your channel and makes them a, a subscriber makes them a supporter of you you never know what video is going to blow up but you being honest and upfront and raw about your feelings being cheated on being left being broken hearted you being honest about that that means everything y'all that means everything that's the first step to you having improvement of yourself. So this is part one, turn your pain into profit. You can do that money-wise, making a video about what you went through, just like I'm doing now. You can write a book about what you went through. You can make a song about what you went through. You can write a poem about what you went through. That may bring you back actual profit, monetary profit, economic profit. You can also profit by Taking a long walk, jogging, running, going to the gym, lifting weights, improving yourself is also turning a profit from that pain that you feel. Okay? So turn your pain into profit. I know it hurts. I know it hurts. All right? But remember, this hurt, this pain, this bad day you're having, it won't last forever. All right? The sun will shine again. Tomorrow will come. This day, this terrible day will not last forever. There will be a new day eventually. All right? All right I love y'all, man. Y'all take care. Have a great day, a great night, depending on where you are in the world. Ah, let me give you something happy to listen to. Here you go. Something happy. Here you go. <laughs> Old dog, anti to chill. Check out the video right there. Check out the video right there. It'll cheer you up a little bit. All right, you guys. Take care. All right, bye. Peace. Bye-bye.